excuse me. <clears throat> so, today I am still sick and we are going to talk about colds, but before we start I want to give you guys a little update. Um, my head is pounding, everything is pounding, I feel so sick. Um, you guys know I was not taking medicine, I was trying to treat my cold for the last day or so, like two days naturally. Um, I'll give you guys a little bit of an update. You know how sometimes you cough up like gunk in your mouth, like in your throat? And it's like a different color. This is kind of gross, so you may want to fast forward this part. Um, but I've been coughing up brown gunk, but it has like blood in it. And it's not like blood blood, but it's like little veins, like little red spots. Um, and I'm really, really sore up like in the back of my throat, up like where my nose connects. Hi, cuckoo. So I think that that's like some of the blood vessels coming out. So I'm like coughing up that kind of stuff. Oh my God, it hurts so bad. And my nose is chapped and my lips are chapped and I've been sleeping and breathing through my mouth. This is tired. I can't even talk. I've been sleeping and breathing through my mouth this entire time because... <clears throat> I can't even breathe through my nose, so I've been breathing through my mouth and it's giving me chapped lips and everything. This is terrible. So, since I've been coughing up blood, I have decided to take medicine. And the medicine still isn't doing anything. So I'm thinking of going to go see a doctor because my ears are hurting too and I hope it's not like something more serious. But anyways, today we are going to talk about one of my pet peeves. We are going to talk about does a cold, er, not does a cold, does being cold make you cold? No, I'm sorry. Does being cold give you a cold? And this is one of my biggest pet peeves. When some person comes up to me and says, oh, you poor thing, you caught a cold. You shouldn't go outside barefoot. Or you shouldn't go outside, you're gonna catch a cold. No, that is not how you catch a cold. Let me explain this to you. Unless you guys already know. You do not get a cold from being cold. Getting a cold, a cold is a virus. It is a little bug, almost like, and it gets into different hosts or organisms, which would be a person, your brother, your mom, and it transfers from host to host, from person to person. And that is what causes a cold. Um, you cannot just go outside and you're in the cold and, oh my gosh, you get a cold. And you can't just, like, go you know, sit on a chair and get a cold. Now, obviously, if you lick a dirty surface, you're more likely to catch the virus, if that makes sense. Now, which doesn't actually make sense. Basically, you cannot get a cold from being cold. So why do people say that? Reason why is because when you're cold, when you're freezing, when your body is cold, it compromises your immune system. What that means, your immune system is what keeps you healthy. So, Let's say that your immune system is compromised. Your immune system is not working properly. When it doesn't have its defenses up, it's going to be easier. It's like a little soldier. You have a wall, you're the castle. You have like a wall around your castle. This wall is your immune system. Now, if your immune system is weak, this little virus that's trying to get in through your castle wall can get to you easier because it can break that barrier. Same idea. When you're cold outside, it weakens your immune system, so you're more likely to catch a cold. Let's say my mom is sick, and I have a great immune system, I go see her, da 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 probably not gonna get sick. Now, let's say that I haven't been sleeping right, I haven't been eating right, it's freezing outside, my immune system is compromised, and then I come in contact with my mom, and she has that virus, she can still give it to me, but I'm more likely to get sick because my defense barrier is not working properly. Um, so that's why people get sick, not because it's cold outside. That's not why you're gonna get a cold. Although it does make sense that you're more likely to have a weakened immune system. And that weakened immune system is more likely to let little bad things in through its little castle wall and get you sick. So that is one of my pet peeves, and this is a short video, and this is a random video, and I hope you guys really don't mind that I'm sick and stuff, because I feel like awful for doing these kind of videos, but you know, I love you, and I want to be here for you every day. So I just want to talk to you about that, and then I'm going to probably go to the doctor sometime soon. Also, I'm probably going to go, I hate going outside when I'm sick, but I, I'm probably going to try to research like some antibiotics, not antibiotics, but like some natural supplements online or something to help me with my headache. Because I'm on Advil right now, but I really don't like it. And my throat, do you hear how much better it feels? It's because I'm drinking my tea with lemon. 
but it's not working very well. So I love you guys, and I hope you don't mind, and I will talk to you all some other time. I'm like curled up in a blanket. Anyways, love you guys, and I will talk to you all very soon.